Hello, my name is Lisa Speaker. This is day two of the 30 day challenge, bringing you 30 day of appellate tips. Brought to you from Boyne Mountain, Michigan at the swimming pool where the kids are playing this morning. Um, today's tip has to do with emergency applications for leave to appeal. And the, the tip for the day is about when you're drafting your emergency motion or emergency application, make sure you put on the cover of the application or motion an explicit deadline when you need a decision by. Try to figure out the date you need the decision and also explain in the cover page why you need that deadline. And then of course within the body of the motion or application, you can further explain the need for the emergency relief. That just really helps the Court of Appeals understand the urgency and to get them to move a little bit more quickly on it. And in most cases, they do take emergencies very seriously and they do move very quickly at the Court of Appeals to decide an emergency motion. But it really helps the court to know a specific deadline that you're facing uh, and what the reason for the deadline is. So I've seen a lot of emergencies where people just say, well, they have to have it by a certain date and there's really, it doesn't really make sense. Like they're just, it's just, it's just an appeal of some order and there really is no timing sensitivity. They just want to know more quickly. Well, that just doesn't cut the mustard. Um, the court may grant you emergency relief and actually decide it more quickly, but if, they're, if, but if you need to decide it, a decision in five days versus 20 days versus 56 days, it makes a big difference about how the court processes it at the Court of Appeals. Um, the other th tip for emergency motions and applications is that it's best to personally serve the emergency motion or application on opposing counsel. Um, if they are on true filing, you can e-file it. But if they aren't, by serving it by mail will delay the processing of the motion or application at the Court of Appeals. So make sure you get personal service if your opposing counsel is not on true filing. And that will help quicken the process when you truly do have an emergency. So look for us tomorrow, our last day in Boy Mountain, for tip number three. Thank you.